हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम स्टैंडिंग एट ललित कला अकेडमी न्यू दिल्ली यहाँ पे जो एग्जीबिशन चल रहा है दिस समथिंग हिस्टोरिकल रोके सुल्ताना फ्रॉम बांग्लादेश हर रेट्रोस्पेक्टिव एग्जीबिशन इज गोइंग ऑन एंड इट विल बी देयर टिल ट्वेंटी सिक्स ऑफ जून और ये फिर यहाँ से ट्रैवल करेगा कोलकाता में सो लेट्स मूव इन साइड एंड टॉक टू रोके सुल्ताना इट विल वन हेल्प इन एक्सपीरियंस आ, बात करते हैं मिलते हैं इन आर्टिस्ट से जानते हैं इनके बारे में लेट्स गो इनसाइड। टुडे इज द ओपनिंग डे द फर्स्ट डे ऑफ दिस एग्जीबिशन एंड द ओपनिंग विल बी डन बाय मीनाक्षी लेखी मिनिस्टर ऑफ स्टेट फॉर एक्सटर्नल अफेयर्स एंड कल्चर डी जी आई सी सी आर दिनेश के पटनायक इना पूरी डी जी बंगाल फाउंडेशन लूबा नाहिद चौधरी एंड एन ऑफिशियल फॉर्म बांग्लादेश हाई कमीशन एज कैन सी आफ्टर कोविड दिस इज वॉट वी वॉन्ट ए ग्रेट एग्जीबिशन ए ग्रैंड ओपनिंग एंड ब्यूटिफुल गैदरिंग ऑफ पीपल दिस वॉट वी वॉन्ट यस बहुत बढ़िया बहुत ही बढ़िया एग्जीबिशन है और आपको बहुत सारे सरप्राइजेस अभी मिलने वाले As you can see on your screen, Minakshi Lekhi enter कर रही हैं and the minister is here for the opening of this exhibition. And now the journey begins. So stay with Art Keeper. Keep watching Art Keeper. Support Art Keeper. Namaskar, very good evening. On behalf of Indian Council for Cultural Relations, it gives me immense pleasure to extend a warm welcome to all our distinguished dignitaries, excellencies, and respected guests. A special welcome for our chief guest of the day, Shubhati Vinayakshi Lekhi Ji, Honorable Minister of State for External Affairs and Culture. Welcome, ma'am. So the program here uh, has been organized by ICCR. in association with the World Foundation Bangladesh with the support of Talent Kala Academy we all gathered here for a book launch and opening of and friends it will be a great exhibition experience jo hoga aapko main abhi se aapko surprises nahi bataunga kuch surprises hain isme bahut mazedar surprises hain aur kuch historical moments hain जिसको मैंने कैप्चर किया है सो स्टे विथ आर्ट कीपर सपोर्ट आर्ट कीपर सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर साथ रहिए हमारे Mr. Muhammad Nurul Islam ji DG Bengal Foundation Mr. Luba Chaudhary artist of the day Ms. Rokia Sultana and Ms. Ida Puri curatorial advisor The inauguration happened on 6th of June 2022 aur ye first day ka ceremony hai opening ceremony lighting of the lamps by the dignitaries so a great moment iske baad shuru hoga real journey Now listen to Ina Puri. 
She began her formal training under the able guidance of Shomnathur, Shalakkar, and Dalai Sarsho and Shantanikitan, where she was a student. Later, she was deeply influenced by Zafiruddin Ahmed and Muhammad Kibriya, who helped her to hone and further understand the technical nuances of print making. Rukia continues to owe these brilliant artists from both Bangladesh and India her gratitude. Rukia believes that her artworks are essentially journals, a reflection of her thoughts and emotions that respond to life around her. A pictorial narrative centers around the figure of Corona, who appears in different avatars, sometimes as a mother, and others an artist or else an educationist, multitasking in her roles as she faces different challenges every day. Sensitive to the conflicts around her, she portrays her personal reflections on loss, displacement, and the imper impermanence of life in her work. It has been a great privilege to be a part of Rokia Sultana's retrospective that opens at Kalikrama Academy this evening. My gratitude to all those who made this exhibition possible, ICCR, Bangladesh High Commission, Bengal Foundation, and Rokia herself. For me, Rokia's elusive, intangible works bring a Tamil Fokir poem to mind. Let me leave you with his evocative words. Go search in your home now. Find out the nest within your eyes. The restless bird that eludes your grasp. There is one bird perched on a single stand inside a house with a thousand rooms. One which disappears the moment you enter. The room is studded with mirrors all around and the bird rests happily in the center. It is impossible to catch it with these frail hands. If you wish to glimpse the bird, find a guide who knows the way. Thank you. Now listen to Rukhaya Sultana, the artist. And also today's team case, Honorable Minister of State for External Affairs. And now you will see the launch of the book, book launching ceremony. ये भी है, ये भी इसी का पार्ट है. It's a beautiful book being launched on Rokeya Sultana's art. और यही वो किताब है जो आप देख पा रहे हैं सामने.
And now listen to Minakshi Lekhi, the Minister of State for External Affairs and Culture. This is the gathering. This is the gathering. Yehi chahiye hume. This is the gathering on the opening day. First day ki gathering hai ye. Artists hain, kafi tarah ke log aaye hue hain, visitors hain, and people are enjoying. Or COVID ke baad, ye fir se shuru hona bahot acha lag raha hai. Bahot hi acha. Or Lalit kala isi tarah se hamesha khula rahe, hamesha exhibit karte rahe. Yehi chahte hain hum. It should be open, and people should be exhibiting. Artists should be exhibiting their works. शट डाउन मत कीजिए इसे बंद मत कीजिए इसे लेट आर्ट सर्वाइव लेट आर्ट सर्वाइव ललित कला बंद मत कीजिए लेट्स हैव एग्जीबिशन ओवर देयर सो फ्रेंड्स आई एम हेयर अगेन ऑन द सेकेंड डे एट सेवेंथ ऑफ जून 2022 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू इंटरव्यू रोके सुल्ताना एट ललित कला अकेडमी न्यू दिल्ली और ये जो वीडियो देख पा रहे हैं आपके सामने ये वही है जो बांग्लादेश में बनाया गया था उनके ऊपर उनके काम के ऊपर उनके जर्नी के ऊपर सो दिल लॉर्ड ऑफ सरप्राइजेज ट्रस्ट मी लॉट ऑफ सरप्राइजेस और ये स्किप मत कीजिएगा ये भाग मत जाइएगा आप आखिर तक देखिएगा वर्क्स जो देख पाएंगे वो आखिर में देख पाएंगे आप आई एम टेलिंग यू ये स्किप करके अंदर चले जाएंगे कोई मज़ा नहीं आएगा बहुत सारी चीज़ें हैं जो इन बिटवीन है सो वॉच द एंटायर वीडियो एंड सडली इन इंडिया वी डोंट हैव द पेशेंस टू वॉच वीडियोज ऑन आर्टिस्ट दिस इंटर स्पेस ऑफ ललित कला अकेडमी Now we are going uh, upstairs, the foyer area. Uh, old poster, old poster. It's a long, long time back. Hmm. इन चीजों को कभी मिस नहीं करना चाहिए. So let's start this journey. Rukaji is sitting over there having a lunch. Uh, we'll not bother her right now. So let's start with the works being displayed. and this i went on the second day on 7th of june 2022 and i interviewed the artist rukaya sultana please stay with art keeper keep watching art keeper
वेल दिस ऑल फ्रेम्ड और ग्लास में है तो कुछ रिफ्लेक्शंस तो आएंगे बट आई एम ट्राइंग माई बेस्ट टू यू नो शो यू द आर्ट वर्क दिस आर प्रिंट्स ग्राफिक प्रिंट्स दिस एचिंग एक्वाटिंट This also print. Very striking works. Very striking. Uh, दिल को छू जाने वाले काम हैं ये और बांग्लादेश के बहुत सारे चीज़ों को उन्होंने दर्शाया है She has shown the entire journey of Bangladesh, the formation of Bangladesh. Okay, from the beginning and what it. And so much of depth is there in our work. बिल्कुल दिल को छू जाते हैं दिल को छू जाते हैं I felt very emotional looking at this all this works. And you should visit this exhibition if you have the time. Or June, I hope June end तक चलेगा ये Till 26th I hope it will be there. 2022 and it will travel to Kolkata then. and he has shown his works his series of mukti yodha this is all prints on paper she is a well known printmaker and painter from bangladesh or in her retrospective exhibition chal raha hai is going on at ladit kala academy New Delhi it will be there till 26th of June 2022 one of a kind exhibition and not to be missed as you can see a lot of reflections are there so glass mein hai to reflections aayenge but uh, i'm trying my best to catch the artwork now let's enter the main exhibition area Look at the wall. Look at the wall. It's beautiful. This is one of the most striking पेंटिंग्स और यहाँ पे दिखाया गया है हाउ वीमेन आर ट्रीटेड इन आवर सोसाइटी समटाइम्स दे आर ट्रीटेड लाइक यू नो गोट छागुलर मतुन छागुलर मतुन मतलब बकरी की तरह ट्रीट किया जाता है सो इज द हेड ऑफ द गोट ऑन द लैप ऑफ ए वुमन एंड दिस वर्क इज वेरी स्ट्राइकिंग वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग वर्क आई बी यूजिंग एनी म्यूजिक म्यूजिक uh, नहीं होगा यहाँ पे look at this wall look at this wall beautiful and it's so it's so touching this place is really beautiful and let's see the works in details
यहाँ पे वाटर कलर भी डिस्प्लेड है प्रिंट्स भी डिस्प्लेड है सो वाइड रेंज ऑफ वर्क्स वाइड रेंज ऑफ टेक्निक्स एंड मेथड्स बिंग डिस्प्लेड एंड आई कैन एश्योर यू दिस वन ऑफ ए काइंड एग्जिबिशन इट्स ए हिस्टोरिक एग्जिबिशन ये एक बहुत बेहतरीन एग्जिबिशन है जो ललित कला में हो रहा है थैंक्स टू आई सी सी आर बेंगाल फाउंडेशन एंड गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया एंड गवर्नमेंट ऑफ बांग्लादेश when you look at the work don't just look at the work from the point of view of you know the colors and the lines and all that you have to be you have to go a little more deeper then only you can understand the essence of the work the war of independence where bangladesh people fought in 1971 for their independence from pakistan main bahut purani baatein kar raha hu aur iske bare mein hum janenge unse us waqt ke cheeze bhi us waqt us daur ke cheezon ko bhi unhone darshaya hai apne kaam mein chahe wo prints ho chahe paintings ho so you have to grab that pain that you know it's very difficult how you look at the work किड्स है दिस शोज द वॉर ऑफ इंडिपेंडेंस एंड बांग्लादेश वॉज हेल्प बाय इंडिया टू अचीव दैट एंड वी आर सेलिब्रेटिंग दैट फ्रेंडशिप ऑफ फिफ्टी इयर्स मुजीबुर रहमान वो लीडर थे जिन्होंने इसको बांग्लादेश को फ्रीडम दिलाया एंड मुजीबुर रहमान वॉज हेल्प बाय इंदिरा गांधी इंडियाज देन प्राइम मिनिस्टर द आयरन लेडी ऑफ इंडिया वो हेल्प मुजीबुर रहमान एंड बांग्लादेश टू अचीव इंडिपेंडेंस फ्रॉम पाकिस्तान जब पार्टीशन हुआ था तो बांग्लादेश को ईस्ट पाकिस्तान बना दिया गया था और वेस्ट पाकिस्तान था आफ्टर इंडिपेंडेंस बांग्लादेश वॉज देयर दैट वॉज ईस्ट बंगाल हमारे लिए आई विल कवर दिस एरिया फर्स्ट then i'll show you this gallery number 1 of lalit kala academy
आप जो आवाज़ सुन पा रहे हैं वो बच्चों के आवाज़ें हैं और बच्चे रिएक्ट कर रहे हैं अपनी तरफ से historic moment which i was talking about on your screen is on the right side arpana kaur india's leading female artist on your left is rukia sultana leading artist from bangladesh ji usi madaj mas ko jao strong women are aaj hi kam ho gaya two neighboring countries so <laughs> good you know something and the artist on the extreme right which is abul salam from kolkata there is a young curator who came to exhibition he is exhibiting in our gallery he told me that your opening was yesterday but we gave images from the last time you know i am not i am not on whatsapp i have this phone and I maybe you didn't pick up phone or something no i Oh, don't I guess? Okay. We all in Bangladesh. We all love Bangladesh. I brought my mom. First thing you do, right? Is our mother's book. We read that book. These are all mommy's books for you. Gypsy, Nandi, Dhara, and Selina who sent translated collection of my short stories. I just, I read. But always I read the book I love. Okay, this is Selina D has translated this. Mummy short stories. Did she know the Tara? Mummy short. I brought this for you. <laughs> and then we read these bags. See, my mother runs a school for girls from slums. Two are for you. Two for Lupa. Two for Abul Bhai's okay, wife. Okay, very happy. Abul Bhai's wife too. Lupa too. You too. And she came to visit Bangladesh. I know. She was hugging the prime minister. See this comedy. This one I will take. You take. Take which one? Two of you decide. And the first one I will take. And see, mummy. I love her. Because I know her mother. That's we so lucky that we even you know it's foreign culture, foreign culture, and it's so touching. I'm just crying. It's fun to me. 61 conferences of sad writers my mother had and these are all the bangladeshi writers who come every year twice in year they come then suddenly these are all see bangladeshi writers all yeah, who come to my mother has two conferences in year so they all come and they all love her yeah. see nurul huda selina di rubana ha Rubana, Selina, the the Jharna Rahman, just previous on your and Jharna is also here. Jharna is here. So they all come to mummies. This is my mother's foundation, and she invites twice a year. Since thirty years, she's inviting Bangladeshi and Afghani, and you know. So this you see also. It's a lot for you. And this is also for you. There's one work that Abul Bhai had bought in uh, page number forty-four. Yes, yeah, see that one hanging in his uh, house. Uh, that big uh, bowl. Bowl. Yeah. Oh my God! Yeah, this is yeah, this a bowl. Yeah, this bowl is I made. <laughs> okay. This is, and I saw your yeah. painting, and I okay. I want to see the show. Let's go. The I'm wearing the mask because I had. Sixteen uh, years back, heart, a lot of problem. Now also with the heart. And you know when I met you, after then I didn't come once in this transit.
subscribe and share thank you so much now you can see the animation done based on the paintings of roka sultana and this is fabulous fabulous animation ab jab dekh payenge aapko kuch aur hi ehsaas hoga and the entire thing has been captured by art keeper
20 minutes. I think we didn't have time. 10 minutes. Shangri La is in Kanar Place. Okay. So from Kanar Place, we are 25 minutes. And I might not. Yeah. I tell this person, a very nice person. So if you have to be in the gallery, you can come in the morning and then we will bring you. We have three museums. And my mother runs a school from my paintings earning since 45 years in my sister's memory who passed away in 1975. So girls come from the slums and they are learning stitching, computer, all free. It's all from my paintings. We get no money from government or any foreign source. But the school is running well. We are happy. Without any grants, the school is... We have four teachers, nine computers, 12 stitching machines, 10 Hindi English, and uh, beauty course, manicure, and they get jobs very fast. Mainly, then uh, uh, hair cutting, hair styling, then all that, you know, and the girls feel very happy. Uh, that is from 10 to 5 every day. They are coming. So I'll explain them. So whichever day you are free, whichever day, so you please just, and then you can, he'll bring you to the I'll take your phone also, you can call me. Okay. Email is the best. I want to email in my phone. I've written my email in that letter. The letter is in the book. And I'll explain them the way. From Shangri-La, 25 minutes, if there's no traffic. So if you leave early. What's the name of your it's an Academy of Fine Arts and Literature. Uh, city 4. And my mother built that building all alone. Three floors. I didn't help her because I was fighting with her. Why are you building? She said, if I can't finish it, I'll give it in charity. But uh, we have 200 uh, miniature paintings, very old, registered with uh, the government, with Archaeological Survey of India. Then 800 folk and tribal painting and sculpture, including the Dhaka, Ghazi Bhatt, I forgot his name, the artist. And we published a big book of that uh, collection. Then uh, we have a little museum of my own work, little museum, my permanent collection. Then the school runs and we have free library with English, Hindi, Urdu, because my mother reads Urdu also. But um, she has lost eyesight in one eye. Mm -hmm. And this eye is only 20 to 25 percent. So she went into very deep depression because she used to read till two at night. Now she can't read the books. But with a magnifying tablet, she manages to have two, two conferences in here with more than uh, 100 writers. So like uh, last month was this online conference with all Bangladeshi and, you know, Ghani and Sri Lanka, Bhutan writers. Next, already she's planning November, physical conference. So they'll come, they'll all come, Nurul Huda, mm -hmm. Selina Di, Channa, and Channa sings always, you know. So it's like one family that she has created. I'll explain to him. See, my mother's maid leaves at 6 o'clock. My mother yes. is a maid because... Ek minute, do. Please, you have a light. Look, go ahead. To walk to the bathroom. This is a beautiful, beautiful picture. Her. Beautiful picture. Beautiful picture. Thank yes. You. Yes. Please. Thank you. Who is he? I am basically documenting for a channel called Art Keeper, ma'am. I have got an Art Keeper. It's there on YouTube. Achha. And I am documenting her person. entire exhibition. Just, just, Paramjit ji. Paramjit ji.
this entire animation is based on her paintings Roka Sultana's paintings so enjoy this animation it's absolutely unique and it's beautiful absolutely beautiful अगर आप पर्सनली जाके वहाँ पे देख सकते थे तो बहुत अच्छा होता और जो जिन्होंने देखा है आई फील दे आर रियली लकी अगर नहीं देख पाते हैं तो वॉच इट ऑन आर्ट कीपर स्टे विथ आर्ट कीपर सपोर्ट आर्ट कीपर Yes. Now we'll be talking to Rukaya Sultana from Bangladesh. Presently, she is having a retrospective exhibition at Lalit Kala Academy. आज उनसे बात करते हैं और यहाँ पे हिंदी, बंगला और इंग्लिश आपको सब कुछ सुनने को मिलेगा. So be prepared. Rukaya ji, welcome to India. And after such a long time, after such a long wait. we can see your works and right now the work just behind her is one of the most iconic works ruka ji please aap apne journey ko kaise shuru karna chahte hain kaise batana chahte hain start with your childhood how was it like kaisa tha wo ki rakam chilo ta choto wala aapne jab bangladesh e chilen seta ki rakam chilo shekhane ki barite keu chaito je apni artist hon or was it like you were a rebel you had to you know rebel out and be an artist my childhood is beautiful mm -hmm. uh, but i have a character from my childhood i am very different to other child mm -hmm. or other my family member always i stick to my opinion right a little stubborn <laughs> and little be Uh, I mean, busy with my own world. Khoya mm hua. -hmm. I I I am somewhere, some other world, another world. I always I go right. to. And my parents very cultural minded. My mother, she love literature. Mm -hmm. She recited lots of poem, okay. which I still remember. Mm -hmm. And one song, first I heard from her. माँ अमार शादा में चिलो आशा ना पूरी लो शॉकोले पुराए जाए माँ। It's uh, like a song for uh, I remember Kali. Yeah. Kali. Yeah. Maybe for Goddess. Or Nala or. Yes yes yes. Or maybe some I am I just um, forget and another song नायरे नायर बादम तूइला उन्देशे जा चूइला because her parents her father is not uh, alive that time but her mother is. in uh, that time in her village in bartaman okay but in that, west bengal that country is very bad country for nishiddha desh for it's before uh, 1971 and my father was a government uh, in a government job so they cannot go they cannot write letter 
something like that. So, so they were they, they were separated basically. Like your mother was in two country. No, there is a, we are not very connected with that time before right. 1971. We are not connected with mm -hmm. India. So and my um, father also be he loves painting and he also loves literature. He studied his bachelor and master Kolkata. Islamia College, which one is now Abul Kalam Ajad, Maulana Abul Kalam Ajad College in, okay. university, with, in Kolkata University, Calcutta. So that way I've I'm, I'm been to very uh, interesting cultural belonging with my family. But I'm, but I'm very peculiar. I always I move around alone and I have some loneliness in my mind. Okay. So, and always, you know, I, when one child or a teenage, uh, always give or uh, give, give her opinion, uh, mm -hmm. his ichha on ichha, you know, mm -hmm. uh, because I have always my own idea, because of maybe today I am a painter, and also I have some fear, so just few days back I told someone that my fear maybe make me painter. Because when I paint, my fear is gone, and, and my ostito, my existence, my mm -hmm. identity. Maybe I have something. I sometimes lost. So when I do my work, background, my parents, both of them, are love uh, literature mm -hmm. and their time poetry and other kind of books. And used to paint from childhood. Ah, but Me? yeah. I paint, but those painting is very different to this. Uh, obviously, nowadays. obviously, a obviously. Tree, boat, house, beautiful woman, uh, kind of. But I'm always deep inside. I am somewhere, some another world. I mm -hmm. live. So that maybe make me this painter because you know uh, I have my own dream world. Mm -hmm. When I started, or I start my work, mm -hmm. then I went my own world and those things coming out in my lots of creatures, so lots of things I cannot see. So you feel like creating your own world within this world? Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah both. Uh, yeah, both uh, yeah. <laughs> I try to make them to come this world uh -huh. and I tr try to them they understand this world or they make a relation with this world. Right. Sometimes they are very good relation and my work also, when I start, I work, mm -hmm. it's like my conversation, my physical relation with my canvas, with my three-dimensional things, with my printmaking. Mm -hmm. so it's it's kind of relation we make together. Mm -hmm. and sometimes very happily finish, done. Okay. Sometimes that conversation is not very going well. Sometimes <laughs> we fight. Right. But sometimes when it's very happily it's done, then maybe my work also mm -hmm. done with. But always, always one artist has uh, an imaginary world for Absolutely. Her. So my imaginary world sometimes very different to others. Everybody I think have uh, different, they have. Right. Uh, different to different. So sometimes they are very uh, kind of so realistic. Because my form and figure, mm -hmm. they are not very real, realistic one. Right. Their expression is abstract, but if you see the drawing, they are very free drawing. Mm -hmm. It's not any very academic or realistic kind of drawing. I, I call, I don't know, it's how people will say, it's a stylized drawing. Okay. And very free, free drawing. And I believe art has no language or boundaries. Mm -hmm. and they are silent spectators and silent entertainers. And it is a matter of perspective mm -hmm. and of the audience. Audience. I want to ask you some some. Uh, what message they take from art? Yeah, I want to ask some tricky questions now. Yes. Okay. Now you'll be in uh, in you'll be getting into hot water. The thing is like. Uh, 1971 yeah. was full of chaos, right? It's a time for rebellion and independence and all yes, that. Yeah. And I have seen a lot of your works which you have shown those things. And that transformation, that pain, 
that angst, that chaos is there on the canvas. How you relieve that thing? You're relieving it. Like you are, you are again in doing it. Again and again you are drawing it. So you're relieving the past. How you do that? That's, that's you're traveling back and doing it. That's a little bit different, you know. But my other work and my this uh, Mukti Juddho series. Yes, Mukti Juddho. It's little different, to, little not maybe more different to others because I have I had that pain mm -hmm. because I saw that Mukti Juddho I'm going. Through. Yes, that's why I was asking. Because that yes. time maybe I'm eleven or twelve, just before my teenage. Mm -hmm. Because this painting is Absolutely. my memory. Yes, I absolutely. I can understand. Pouch of mother, because my father is a police superintendent of mm -hmm. one district, mm -hmm. and he fought for. Pakistan he was also fought for. Okay. Yeah, because he not surrender to them police line, they cannot enter. When they try to enter, mm -hmm. and they little bit maybe that just time to time is. I jato tuko ami jani. That they prepared before that. They cannot go in, you know. They okay. don't take charge from my father, not the ammunition charge. So they are prepared. So when they attack and they fought and then they are spread out, mm -hmm. then second day again they hide somewhere. From there, they again they um, attack to the pub to the mm -hmm. public, then okay. again this public and police answer all together, they fought for army. So then whenever I work in this, uh, the, that is also one conversation, maybe I talk to my father, I share with all the Mukti Jodha, the Shuhid Mukti Jodha, mm -hmm. that uh, physically and mentally abuse women, because it's a big or amount of women, uh, they lost their shop home, you know, and I always give my respect to them, that Shuhid, 30 lakh, 30 million, million, right. Uh, right. Uh, mm -hmm. 30 million, maybe more, nobody yeah, knows the right more. number, yeah, because we cannot count, nobody knows the right nobody number, nobody knows, uh, yeah. so those, uh, uh, even the unknown fighters are there, yeah, lots of unknown fighters, lots of villages nowadays, Right. Suddenly, there is, they find out one Konokabu. Yes. Just they found the Joshua. Public body in Huatha. Yeah, they Joshua, did. they right. find lots of, lots of. Them. Absolutely. They find, found a Konokabu and they give their, uh, those uh, very respectfully, those, their uh, body to genocide mm -hmm. museum. Okay. Some, some. So that way I work with the Genocide Museum, I mm -hmm. give them And where exactly is the Genocide Museum? Then Khulna. Khulna, right. Khulna is the, the city or district where they are the most, most people are killed Kill. by Pakhana by India. Because there is a lots of jute mill, recent jute mill has they put the big furnace burner where they put uh, that coal for running maybe hmm. electricity, maybe I, I'm sorry, maybe some of my things are wrong because some real word, but they call it furnace because I saw it's a big and okay. they put a human figure inside of uh, Something like the, something what the uh, Nazis did, something what the yeah, Nazis did to the Jews, much, yeah. something what the Nazis did to the Jews, same thing. They burn human bodies over yeah. there. says so I cry I something haunt me my inside I Absolutely. feel that pain Absolutely. because I remember how we hold my mother hand because father was in Mukti Juddho we hold my mother hand we seven sister and brothers we travel here and there we cannot eat cannot find proper food so it's a uh, but I, we are very happy that uh, 16 December we get our joy right our independence and we are grateful always that india helped and in a way us. india also yeah, indira gandhi was there at that time yeah, indira gandhi and india the indian people help us and support Absolutely. us the indian army was there yeah i remember that uh, the refugee camp how how many maybe equity what call equity crore one crore is like yeah, uh, it's that uh, they say one crore maybe hmm? more or 
something. Nobody knows the right they number. Take shelter. Yes. Yeah, shelter in this uh, area. So that thing. These are that thing. Yeah, that thing has inspired you. And one more thing. Are you using elements of Taoism yeah. in your art? Uh, yes, and I'm, I'm, I'm quoting this question on behalf of Aloptojin Tushar yeah. from Bangladesh, yeah. and this was suggested by him. Credit unko jata hai, to isiliye main unka naam lunga. The credit goes to Aloptojin Tushar in Dhaka University. He is a teacher over there, and he suggested me this question. So please, ma'am, now tell me about this secret. <laughs> because when uh, I'm little bit spiritual, this is a contrast. This is a contrast. Tao and this chaos. Uh, oh, chaos, maybe a Tao. Hai. I think there is somewhere because Tao is a philosophy. Yes. You know? So this it's philosophy, a Japanese philosophy. you aesthetically strong, and I when because I'm little bit uh, philosophically and spiritual mind. Mm -hmm. uh, because I love when I go up and I understand Alam Fakir. Mm -hmm. So the meaning of khachar bhitor achin pakhi achin pakhi kemne ashe jai ami ek dino na dekhilam tare dekhilam that is ek dino na dekhilam tare then there is another song barir pashe arshi nagor dekhinai tare something there is also some arshi nagor so that's the thing is that tao is a, it's a um, very natural feeling when i started in shantini kotak mm -hmm. bharati university so it happened in Shandini Yeah, I you know I studied there. So ah, yeah. we the there is our syllabus, there is Taoism and Zenism. Mm -hmm. So it is our aesthetical course. Okay. So these aesthetics have that one uh, the yin and yang, which one male and female energy. Right. Both they meet and then they circle and then they the, it is the eternity. Mm -hmm. Then they give, they they go and uh, went there and finish make a new energy. Right. Then again that the circle comes. So there is some more uh, point is there. So I think the life also you give uh, you born, then you your journey. Then again you went and then you. But that journey is not a finish. Then you meet again and again there is some energy started from from there. So. These are also when I paint this work. So some of those philosophy or spirit, spiritual feelings always come to because how I uh, compose them, and the color. It, this is our flag color. Mm -hmm. But it's still, always this my this series are very different to my other works. Right, Ruka ji, uh, you have a life which is full of surprises. You play multiple roles, uh, and you are wearing multiple hats also. So it's yeah, one of I them. Love <laughs> it's one of them. So you're also a teacher. You teach art in Bangladesh, in Dhaka, and you exhibit it all over the world, globally. Hmm. So tell us something about that. Aapka zindagi ek artist se alag hatke. Teacher ka kya role hai? What exactly should be the role of a teacher? How you inspire students? See, I am putting up this question for all the viewers. There are a lot of students in India and different parts of the world. They are watching it right now on Art Keeper and they might be thinking about you. What kind of a teacher you are and how you inspire students to become good artists? Please. My view is very different to others. I think maybe there is some teacher like that. I don't feel or feel like I'm a teacher. I grew with them. Mm -hmm. When my first year student, they started their first first year, I also started with them first year. <laughs> so I also, they study, I so also you start, study. Okay. Yeah, then when they finish their master, I also finish my master again. Then again, the new batch come, when okay. they started year, their first year, second That's year. That's great. So I just share my thought, my feeling, mm -hmm. and I learn from them. And maybe I share. Because I'm not that kind of teacher, because I'm an artist, I share my thought and every time I'm working, you know, I work. You are a practicing artist, basically. Yeah, practicing artist, so from that they can learn something. Absolutely. How I speak with you, I Absolutely. just uh, speak with them, share my thoughts with them. Okay. And tell us something about your international exposure, your exhibitions globally. How it impacted you? 
and you know you have participated in a lot of binales also so what kind of growth you had from all these things all these international exposures there are there are hundreds of questions for you right now but i can only figure out few of them yeah you don't have the time yeah, i know i think i'm very lucky that 1995 uh, mm -hmm. i got bharat bhavan gopal the grand prize okay there is uh, the great uh, artist uh, respected mr jyoti bhat one of the judge right. and one print maker very well known from france and another is from england mm -hmm. so that's my first ex experience to come uh, one because you know 1995 i'm also very young i came this been a nally for taking my mm -hmm. uh, award and after that i traveled lots of different countries i okay. got french uh, scholarship and i stay in paris momar okay. and very recent 2011 12 i got a award or grant from fulbright okay. because i'm a fulbrighter and 2016 i got a residency in, in university of new south wales okay. and i had a show and united states also i travel a lot lots of oman and lots of different egypt lots of different countries so that's every every you you, you say one word very true that these are all full of surprises for me right so for and i europe i went england for participate uh, did another exhibition it's organized by commonwealth games team mm -hmm. for commonwealth country okay. india Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Pakistan. So, but everywhere when I went, I, I, sometimes I told my students and young fella mm -hmm. that open your eyes okay. and uh, hear properly, see what's going on. Mm -hmm. So, lots of thing you can learn from there. And also, when you work, close your eyes. Close your ear. So that kind of then I feel like that I I don't see I am I deaf and dumb. So my inside the feelings come to my. Okay. Uh, it's like Tao, because the Tao artist when they sit in front of their work, mm -hmm. they sit zero mind. They call zero state mind. Okay. So they just feel like they are praying zero okay. state mind, and they think they are ink and brush, mm -hmm. and when they create something, they can so they have a, new. They have one empty mind. And they start creating. That's what you were yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, but they always their their relation be because the in and young brush is in, so ink is young, canvas is in, the hand is young. So two energy, always two energy together and make another third energy. But I I believe some that kind of things. But still there is a that way I can talk to my canvas work. work and canvas. Yeah. Make a relation with them. It's a relation between me and my canvas, between yep. the figure and uh, color, mm -hmm. and everything. Thank you so much for your time. This was absolutely fabulous. And I believe in humanity. That's my uh -huh. humanity. That's really, That's it shows, right. in, your yeah. it shows Manubi, in your work. And it shows in your work. Manobikata is. Manobikata. Yes. Very in Bangla, it's Manobikata. Humanity. And it shows in your work. Thank you so much Thank for your time. You. Thank you. This art keeper, and I'm documenting the works of Rokeya Sultana from Bangladesh. It's currently going on at uh, Lalitkala Academy, New Delhi, and then it will move on to Kolkata. You must have seen the videos where I have shown Arpita Singh or sorry Arpita Kaur and Rukhaya Sultana talking to each other
Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe and share. Please stay with Art Keeper. Support Art Keeper. Thank you so much.